Olam dineni we marama. Olam dineni we marama. Olam dino amanan ke dini we kayama e. Omo adiro ya. Olam dino amanan ke dini we. Where is this one coming from? Nkai de biru kan si amanaja. Okay, what happened? Are you all right? Mama, don't mind him. I'm very sure it's coming from that bed center and they must have eaten all his money. Begging me. Oh, Mama, you didn't know. Anytime you don't see him around, he's always there. Betson. I don't leave my kid. Leave him alone. To a queen. Don't mind her. You're talking nonsense. Mm -hmm. well, yeah, Mike, how many times have I asked you to go get a job? Eh? Mama. Really? Do you know that the shop where I went to apply for a job belongs to Uncle Ugo? Eh? Snatching your boyfriend. Ugo? Wait. wait, wait. Eh? No, you're, you're not telling me the truth, are you? Mama, that's true. Mama, do you know that? Do you know that big supermarket? Mm -hmm. After evening market, before the cathedral. Yes. Bam. The one on the right. Bam. Hey. Mama, that big supermarket belongs to Go. Are you serious? I'm telling you. Biko, where did he get all this money from? When? How? Mama, that's not even the problem. What is the problem? Get it about the problem. Mama, the way he treated me today, I felt so embarrassed. Mama. I felt like the ground should open and swallow me. Mama, that man, he said I should not call him Uncle Ugo again. I should address him with sir. Mama, he said that if I should address him as Uncle Ugo again, that I will lose my job. Ha! The job that you have not even started. I'm telling my sister. Hey! Hello, pal. This Ugo we are talking about, is it not the same Ugo that your sister helped before going abroad? Mama, this way. that is him. Nobody, nobody can trust him. Who upon your trust is Hey! 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 Is there food? Because me, I'm very, very hungry. That is long gone. Hey, there is food. I'm coming. Leave me alone, Joe. That guy denied it completely. That guy is such an unrepentant liar. Why? I told you. You might be wrong. There's no way sister will send him money without letting us know. It's not possible. Hi. Mama was right. I know what I'm saying. That guy is lying. That guy is lying. He's not saying the truth. Anyway, we're about to find out. Let's wait for Mama to return. Come and sit down. You're just stressing yourself. <laughs> that guy thinks he's smart. He cannot fool me. My man, he cannot. Hi. Uh, uh, my daughter, I understand absolutely. If you go, I want your parents, and we expect you to tell us the truth. We have a reason for pressing for an answer. I'm a quick fine name. Give us the right answer, please. Mona. Sister, a very important reason at that, though. Hmm. In, 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 Stop laughing. This is not a laughing matter. Papa has something to tell you. Uh, mama, I am here. Well, uh, if you said that um, you've not been sending money to Ugo, then it means that what people have been saying and uh, the rumors going around is true. Yeah. Ha! See so, hey, hey. They are saying that he used his mother for uh, a money ritual. That's what the villagers are saying. Now, about the expensive. You, you ask No problem. Let me shock you. After Ugo finished the burial of his mother, refusing his uncles and distant relatives to be part of it by way of contributing financially, he became rich overnight. Ugo now has mega shops and supermarkets. He even built house uh, mansion in the outskirts of this village. Well, I don't want us to continue naming his assets and property. What I want you to know is behind the man as soon as you come back from overseas, remove your mind from Ugo until we are certain how he made his money. <laughs> <laughs>
Mm-hmm. That's what we are saying. Let's take this from Mother Day. Uh, no. Uh, 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 chill, chill. It's obvious you're not supporting. Okay? That is how she reacts. Okay. When she mm-hmm. finishes her own, she will do pay the phone. Oh, so what? Can I have a phone? Uh, 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 every way that is a way. You see? I told you Ugo wasn't collecting any money from sister, but you wouldn't listen. You need to learn to listen to me. You think I believe all the cook and blue stories she was telling Papa on the phone? Eh? Oh. Wait. You think she was lying? She didn't just lie. She's trying to cover up for Ugo. Look, I don't know what you have against Ugo. I've given up. I don't know what that Ugo gave to you. Otaka Omaka. You go, go Mora. Amaka? 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 You're still looking sick. I told you to go to the hospital. I'm fine. I'm even recovering. Recovering? Yeah. Like this? Ah, you don't look good though. Are you... Are you pregnant? No, I'm not. Ah, no, I'm you, you little children, you thought you could do this, this. <laughs> Surprise somebody. You're sure nothing entered there. Please, come on. Okay. Fine. You feel better, eh? Mm-hmm. All right, so all this while you've been away from your business, how has the business been coping? Don't worry, they're doing just fine. Mm. All right, if you say so. Okay. You're fine, eh? I'm fine. Um, let me get your food. Okay. Go back to Uncle Go and Stamaka to apologize to them. I don't understand this kind of life. Obi, shame to you. Shame to you. What is wrong with you, Obi? What is wrong with you? Why do you like being unreasonable? Listen, we don't need to apologize to Brother Go for any reason. I believe his hands are not clean and we do not want to be part of his wealth. You know, I know. Ebuka, how do you not know that his hands are not clean? Yes, because. If his hands are clean, we should be hearing here, but the girl is suffering, suffering from one kind of sickness. But now his hands are clean. Do you know why I said it? Because every second he's gaining, he's progressing. So how do you now want Obi? me to believe that his hands are not clean? From my own understanding, from my own point of view. Yeah, daughter. I will use the shop and carry. Where is she? 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 Where is I grew up and when I look at you, I know. You 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 You
I mean, if if we go shut up, I say listing and listing good go. A child who bends over a short elder and gives him a knock will soon be the same child. The short elder will bend over his grave and pour sand into it. Eh? And I walk in the hand. I'm you make So how is it my business? Huh? Short or oh, short elder bend, another child bend. How does it concern me? What's my business with it? Huh? How I made my money is not your business. That's what you want. I'll tell you the source of my wealth. You go and scatter it. When I was in this village suffering, why didn't you ask for the source of my poverty? Now that I have money, you ask me, don't, don't disturb me. Oh. It is not your business. Don't tell me any nonsense, please. What's how I made money? Hmm? Let me just shock you now. Ugochuku, you will swear before the oracle yes. that you have no hand in your mother's mysterious death. Yes. You are a madman. You must swear. Mo, I am a madman. I said you are a madman, both of you. You must swear before the shrine. You are a madman. How am I sure you didn't even kill my mother? Yes, because you are very wicked. Ah. Very, very wicked. Okay. Sell land, let me treat my people you refuse. You killed my mother, this man, you're telling me nonsense. Rubbish, I said it. Nah, 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 okay. Mad people. Get away nah, your okay. I'm going to put it on. I ain't not the one that sold his land. Let me just tell you something. I ain't the one that sold his land. Let me just tell you something. Eh? You are on involved your in the cleaning of that woman. On your hand. On your hand. You're not the one that sold his land. You're not the one that sold his land. I will get on whom you are. I will tell you. Eh. Eh. Eating. What's wrong? It's our brothers. I've been thinking about them for some time now, and I think you should invite them. Invite them here to do what? I don't know. That's to your brothers. I've even wondered how they feed. How they feed is not my business. They'll be feeding somehow. I mean, how you? I told them to come in with me, move in. They refused. I can't, I can't make their choices for them. They're adults. They choose for themselves. Uncle, maybe they have changed their mind, but they just don't know how to approach you. Why? I mean, uh, it's not as if no one can approach me. I'm easily approachable. If they want to talk to me, they can come here. I give them the address. They can always reach me. When you were there when I moved in here, I told them to come. They refused. They said they don't need my help. So what am I supposed to do now? Kneel down and beg those those boys. Come on now. They can always reach me. Like I said before, they're my brothers. They will always be my brothers. I'm always there. Anytime they want to reach me, they can reach me. Eat your food, huh? Be happy. Can't you see the time? Why are you late? Do you want to run down my business? Huh? I'm sorry, sir. I'm not... Ah, bro, how are you doing? Welcome, man. I'm sorry, sir. My mother has been sick for the past three days now. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. How does that concern me? Your mother has been sick. My own mother is dead. So what do you want me to do? If your mother is sick or your mother decides to die, how does that affect me? 
Why are you running down my business, my friend? I'm sorry, sir. I'm sorry. I haven't had my salary for the past six months now. I was hoping if you could give me any amount so I can take my mother to the hospital. Please, sir. I should give you any amount to take your mother to the hospital. Huh? From where? I'm asking you now. Sir, my mother has not had any medication since the last one we both finished. You're very stupid boy. Please get out of bed. Get out! You're very stupid boy. For the past six months, we've not been making money. Are you aware? You know? For the past... Oh, oh, you know? So where am I supposed to get money from? If your mother is sick or your mother is dying, how does it concern me? I think I'm going to go in there and go and walk. Go and walk, my friend. Tell your mother that we have to have the space for cleaner. You can come and do cleaner and make, make some money to take care of her. Hey! Hey! Said you want to finally come and meet me here. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry for not coming all this while. It's okay. Now that you're here, it's fine. Mm -hmm. Do you want anything? Of course, I'm hungry. Come and take me to somewhere good. While I'm here. Hey, you're going to eat now. Anything you want is oh, you really? eat. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, sir. Sorry, sir. You're an idiot. You're an idiot. Do you know? Sorry. You're a very stupid boy. Accept it. Yes, sir. Okay, me. So I just got a distress call right now that my mother has been rushed to the hospital. And I can't see her. You are fired. So you can now go and take care of your mother. Perpetually. You are fired. Go. Go. I said go. Of all the times to be burden on me is now. Get out of my bed. You are fired. Go. I'm sorry, sir. Look at go. Go now. This boy, you are fired. Go and take care of your mother. Please, sir. Waka. My salary, sir. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Have you been able to raise anything? No. And Mama's health is becoming worse day by day. There's no money for her treatment. Have you told your boss about how bad Mama's health is? It might help, who knows? Yes, I did. So what, what did he say? He sacked me. Sacked? He did what? He goes sacked me without paying me my seven month salary. He sacked me without giving me a dime. Not even a penny. You don't know what to do now. Just lying down here. They refused to attend to her because of money. And the worst is that Sister Chinjiri has refused to call. So she has not called to you now? She hasn't. What are you people doing here? Huh? When you should be with your mother, how is she? Mama's situation is getting worse. Huh? The situation is bad. Getting worse? Yeah. Just wait. Huh? No, 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 no. Can't you just take it easy? Why would you go hit us this much? After everything is that you need to be before we try. Why? What has he done this time? Oh, we sat you. I remember. That's not it. It's not it. So what else? Brother Go has another girlfriend. What? And by the way they are going about it. I think they will get married soon. Oh my god. Oh my god. So what I know first time. My daughter. <clears throat> we intended for the meeting to be for you and your siblings. But your brother Ugo has refused to 
honor our invitation. That's why we invited you. Um, <clears throat> your hmm? um please go straight to the point. Yeah? Hmm? This young lady here doesn't have all the day. Biko? Um, <clears throat> Amaka, we are bothered about your two brothers, Obi and Ebuka. The other day, we met uh, Obi packing block, loading block to so warm. Hmm? The other day, I saw Ebuka loading a uh, bus in a motor park. Why their senior brother has the money to help them? What is happening? Uncle, Uncle, did he ask them what the problem was? Because if you did, they would have told you that my brother and I have begged them to move into our new house with us, but they refused. Refused? They refused? They refused. Imagine, it's not refused. Of course, they refused. Uh, what happened? I, I, I don't know. I don't know. You, you, you have to ask them by yourself. Well, um, okay, in that case, um, Ichi Ugezu, the ball is now in your court. Eh? Because, you can't even believe the ball is now in your court. You can't even believe the ball is now in your Dam Cameroon. I'm going to I know that Dam Cameroon have opened it. When I buy a book, you will put a game on offer. I came on offer. People are like a model. Million on eBay. Oko Kuku Kaye Kuyo. Kaka Begin. Hm? I am where I go. Joe Grizzly.
So what happened? Are you from this village? Yes, of course. We are, we are from this well, village. We have lived almost our whole lives in Anita. Mm -hmm. Working for a man that has fleets of shops. So I used to manage the painting and my brother does the, the cement. Yes, and when our mother died, wanted to come back for her burial, but the man refused. So we had to forfeit our jobs. Uh -huh. You forfeited your jobs because of your mother's burial? <laughs> yes, we had to. We had to pay last respect to our mother. Ha. So why is he being so mean? Like, even me, I'm looking for money to pay for my mother's treatment in the hospital. Wait, sorry. Are you Chinyere's brother? I mean, Michael. Yes, that's me. Like, how did you know my name? I said it. I said it. How, how can you just forget our faces like that, now? Nah? Uh, uh, it's me, Ebuka, and my brother Obi. We used to be very close friends back in the days. Wow. Ah. Ebuka. Ebuka. Obi. I know that I'm lying. What happened? What happened to you two? Like, we used to know each other back a long time ago. What happened? Wow. Yes, sir. It's true. You know, um, we're staying with one of our uncles long before our father died. And we stayed until he he introduced us to the man that took us in. And we began to walk under him. Then I decided to send us away just a year of our settlement. Ah, people have really suffered though. Hmm? Anyway. You know me, I'm looking for money to pay for my mother's um, treatment. That's why I joined this media job with this, my friend here. And see what they paid me, well, just 1,000 there. My brother, don't forget about that. So, uh, where is your mother? She has been sick for a very long time now. She's in the hospital. What? Mm -hmm. Yes. Sick? Very, very sick. Do you want to go and see her? Mm -hmm. uh, yes, we would like to see her. Okay, now let's go now. Nice to meet you. Oh, whoa. All right, here we are. Welcome to my home. You like it? Wow! Oh, you have a lovely place here. Thank you. How come you've been staying all alone in this mansion? <laughs> Anyways, I am sure it was good while it lasted. I am here. Tell all your girlfriends to stay here. How are you? How are you? How are you? Good. <laughs> your sister that you are. Oh! I'm his girlfriend. Felicia is the name. Alright, let me show you to your room. Huh? Um, are you sure she is your sister? Come on, I'm room now. Why did you embarrass my, my guest like that? She, she tried to shake you and you ignored her. Why? I'm talking to you. Did you smoke something? But uh, are you even listening to what I'm saying? You've not said anything. I've been the one talking here asking me if I'm, I'm listening. But uh, what is wrong with you? What has come over you? You just have one year for Chinere to come back. And you are inviting another person, another woman into this house. That innocent girl left this village because of you. But uh, just one year. What is it? You're just trying to complicate everything, complicate this. I don't understand. What am I complicating? Explain to me. I don't... I don't know. 
Uh, I'm sorry, it's fine, it's fine. Just... Oh, now let me understand you. But I, I don't know, honestly, I don't know what to say right now. Just do you, it's fine, it's fine. Oh yeah, sorry, sorry, you've always been on my side. I love you now, you're my sister. What's that? A man has to be a man. Sometimes a man's body will just be doing like this. You have to, you know, have to do something now. But that, that is none of my business. Your brothers are doing many jobs and they're the talk of the village right now. Please, you'd rather bother about your brothers and wait for Chinere to come back than all this. What do you want here? What do you want here? What do you want? Did, did I just hear you say how? Does this place look like bush in your eye? In other words, you want us to pack and follow you. Apoya? Mr. Man, leave this company. You are making me laugh. <laughs> if you push me, huh? If you push me, I will forget that you are my brothers. What I'll do to you, you'll not like it, believe me. Okay, she never pulled now. In my in my father's house, my own house, you're saying I should leave. Are you, are you did you smoke? Pack your things, let's go to my mansion. Oga, leave this house. Carry your ritual money and your bloody car and get out of this company right this minute. You killed Mama just because you want to be rich and satisfy your human and devilish conscience. Leave this company right this minute. Leave! What is going on here? If I hear your voice here, I will slap you, don't be silly, and send you to FNC hospital for plastic surgery. Get out, both of you. Leave. I said leave. Carry your hurry and leave. You want to be big man overnight? You don't want to go. I am with you. Let's go and pack. No, that's too low. Let's go and pack. It's like. I'll forget that we are brothers. I'll deal with this boy too. I don't know why they are shouting. Oh yeah, both of you, get out. Sir, for Carry your honey and leave! Out of this company. Okay, what? what are you people doing? You don't bother. You don't want to go. Get out! Get! Get out! Get out! Get out! Get out! Well, Ebuka, Obi, your actions was to an extreme. Eh? People shouldn't have pulled on them now. Nah. Even his innocent guests that did nothing to you before. Listen, Michael, none of those two people are innocent. Ugo is a murderer, and his so called honey is a gold digger. Michael, just go to Buddha Rose for, for now. Just mm. forget about them. Uh, Michael, that reminds me. How is she? <laughs> My mother. Uh, yes. Mm. Um, she's fast recovering. The daughter said that she'll be discharged tomorrow next. Wow. And she wants to see you both. Oh, that's the great news. Um, Obi, let's go. We should come, let's leave this place. Obi, let's go, let's go. What is it? Like them? Let's go, Biko. Can you imagine the kind of man I want to get married to? Bunch of nobodies gave me the embarrassment of my life and you could not do anything. Hugo, is this how you we? Oh, don't tell me to shut up! Do not try it, else I will lose it! Don't tell me to shut up! You disgust me! You allowed those idiots to give me a cold bath and you could not do anything. Listen, if you ever defend any woman in your life, Ugo, God will punish you. Uh, enough. God enough. will punish you. I said you. enough. Enough, please. One more word from you, you won't like what I'll do to you. Enough. You're ah. not man enough. Oh. 
Cynthia, honestly, I am telling you the truth. I have never been this embarrassed in my entire life. What kind of a man could not stand to protect his woman outside? Ugochukwu is nobody. He is nothing but a useless feminine goat. He is not supposed to be wearing trousers, honestly. He is meant to be wearing skirts, tying wrappers, because he is useless. He disgusts me. I regret ever going to that his useless house with him. I'm telling you. Babe, I beg, I beg. I'm not in the right frame of mind right now. Please, let me talk to you later. Said what? I told you, didn't I? Oh. You're always dramatic when you want to make a point. You told me what. Speak now. You have to send that fee you call a girlfriend wherever you put her from. You've started, though. You have started. You're going to get me angry. What does that mean? Mm -hmm. I don't know what happened, where you both went to, but she was busy reporting you to her friends through voice uh, call. Calling you all sorts of names, degrading you. Uh, she did that. Yes, she did. Are you sure? Of course. Mama, Go has completely changed. He now lives in a mansion with his sister Amaka. Mm -hmm. I am sure none of you know this part. That to go has been living with a woman. You know, the day he sacked Michael and refused to pay his accumulated debt, I knew immediately that something was wrong somewhere. Mana, Ima, the one that pains me the most is that for four months now we've not heard from your sister. <laughs> I don't have worry because. She has never stayed this long without calling. Good afternoon. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Good boy, sir. So. Oh my god, oh my god. Don't talk. You go and get themselves. Okay, sit, sit. Okay. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. You're welcome. Thank you. I hope you're fully recovered now. I'm, I'm doing well now. My name was Yakov. You didn't even come with anything, knowing that I'm sick. Oh, well, I told him on time. And he refused. Mm -hmm. But you would have brought it yourself. Eh? He may chain on. But that's me. okay. Since you didn't bring color, we will give you. Even a member of I remember when I categorically begged Jenny. I appealed to her not to forget us. Now look at what is happening. We had to sell the only land we had to send this girl to overseas. She went there and abandoned her family. This is the seventh month of the year, and we still haven't heard from her. Now, are you sure that nothing is wrong with my daughter? Nothing is wrong with Chinyera. She's just lost in the crowd. She has allowed the inferior of the white man's land to turn her, her attention away from home. Well, the thing is, if she has refused to get in touch with us, then maybe we should reach out to go. I'm sure she will never turn her back on me, but it might have some news for, for, for us. You are right. In that case, I will see you go tomorrow. Okay. You are right. What a clear. I have a word of communicating with that boy. You have a word. Oh, yeah, after the day he was given a title, his madness ascended to high heaven. 
They gave him a tantrum. Yes, ma'am. Yeah. Oh, two body were one. one. Yeah, I know. <laughs> and the most crazy part of it is that these villagers have now turned and start singing his praise as they are singing his praise, he's throwing money. Only a boy or two bali go one. Hmm. Oh, no, I did it. Eh? Oh, also, Gunny, my cousin. Hmm. It means here, Cassis, say, when me, he went there to, 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 to dive those monies flying on air. Who must have waited a long time for that for where? Yeah, pity coin. As we speak, also, 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 Gunny is at the orthopedic there. So his leg has been cauterized. I'm thinking of happy Korea. I'm careful, I'm careful. He goes about flaunting his new wife to the villagers. Huh? Eh? You can't care about flaunting new wife. He says it's not true. It's, it's, it's not true. You say not true or true? If you could. Wake up. You Jama, wake up. It's a new wife. Mama, his new wife. <laughs> the whole villagers. Hey, ah. She don't even understand what I am saying. Oh, two bali women. If you see how the money is I'm moving on there, we are still talking about wife and, 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 and the, the money. Don't argue it, all. Don't argue, Mama. If I Excuse me. Are you talking to me? Are you okay? How many are we here? You don't talk to me in such manner. Don't be silly. Listen, I don't tolerate rubbish. <laughs> Neither do I. You know, every single day in this house, all you do, you cook, you eat, you fry, you eat. Tell me, is there any law that says that I have to wash the dishes after you are done using them? Let me ask you a question. What exactly is your duty in this house? Are you talking to me? Of course I am talking to you or have you gone deaf? What exactly is your duty in my husband's house? Now listen. If you do not want to be thrown into the streets, this should be your first and last time of questioning me instead of doing what you are supposed to do in this house. The next time you try it, believe you me, you and the dirty things you call belongings will be thrown out. Excuse me. Okay. Are you okay? Are you crazy? Hello. I'm not fine. I'm not fine. Your sister wants to kill me. Your sister, in fact, she has killed me. Where are you? You need to start coming home. Oh, mom, your sister has killed me. I did not do anything to her. I was on my own and she came and started fighting me. I did not do anything. She broke my right hand. I can't even move my right hand. I can't do anything with it. It's burning me. <laughs> Fight my girlfriend. 
What's wrong with you? You see the, the, the injury that she sustained? See, next time you try that kind of rubbish, I'll forget that you're my sister and I'll deal with you. Did you even ask her what she did to me? Whatever she did! Anyways, I don't blame your boss. Are you, are you talking to me? Eh? In my house? Are, are, you, are you talking to me? Brother, eh? Brother, Say you're sorry. sorry. Say you're sorry. Sorry, sorry. I'm sorry. I don't know what is wrong with you. How dare you? In my own house, you're telling me you, that you don't blame me. When you build your own house and you invite me, if I come there, you can talk, talk nonsense. Try that nonsense again. Hey, Phil Emebel. Mama, I came to see you. You came to see me? To see me? Why? I heard you're not feeling well. So oh! I <laughs> so you came to find out if I'm dead? How can you say that? I how, came to see you. How can I say that? My son worked for you for seven good months. You didn't pay him a dime. Even when he came to tell you that I was sick in the hospital and he needed the money for my hospital bill, you chased him away. Eh? I mean, look at you. After what Chinere did for you before she left. What are we even talking about? Eh? Four good years. Four good years my daughter has been gone and we never laid an eye on you. Now you're here. It is heavy, Megini. Eh? I hope your conscience is judging you. I hope so. Mama, it's not like that. Mm. I I've been very busy. Yes, that's why you've not seen me all this while. I've been very busy trying to make ends meet. It's not easy. Ugojoko, you know what? I think you should leave my compound. You are not accepting me. Are you hearing me? But I know one thing for sure. Whoever Chinere is, whether dead or alive, would have been seeing you at two court. Now take your 305 flying center and the two division out of my compound because of thunder. Makatonda, you babu mother here. Makatonda. Makatonda. Umbrella, 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 what they are saying, is it true? Was I not the one that helped you? Ugo, who did you help? Hmm. Where's my money? Which eh? One? How did you help me, Ugo? Which money? I gave you everything. Every time I ask more, I borrow money or get money from anywhere, it is you I give the money to. Give so to how who? did you help me? You gave to Johnson and all your numerous boy boyfriends, not me. See, I'm trying so hard to be calm so that the, 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 my workers will not start insulting you. Eh? You are going to push me and start talking, you know? I will, start talking. I will start Ugo, talking. you need to talk did today. You, did you not use my destiny to travel eh? abroad? You say which destiny? Was it not my destiny you used? Do you have destiny? <laughs> Do you have a destiny, you go? Uh, no, answer me. Which destiny? That I travel and go abroad, I stay under the sun, I stay outside, morning, afternoon, and I just to make money? And you're here claiming all the money that I gave to you, you go? Give me, give me my money, you go. Didn't give me, give me my money, you go. You not give me anything. Hey, God. Ugo, if you don't produce that money, I will scatter this whole shop, I will scatter everywhere. You will either give me the money or you will produce everything that I asked you to do with that money. Produce what? Scatter no, no, what? Scatter my business. Hey, my business. Scatter it. Okay, no problem. Come on, scatter it. See, I'm not going scatter anywhere. It. Scatter it. Go, go, don't go. Don't you go anywhere. Come on, scatter it. We catch you and bin. We catch you and God will punish you. What were you doing when, when, when we were in the village? What were you doing? Giving me small, small money. Small, small money. And meanwhile, you were following Johnson and all, all those useless boys. Small, small money. Mm -hmm. I didn't even know that I was giving you my, 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 my destiny without knowing. Is it not true? I went to over 10 places. 10 spiritual houses, they all mentioned your name. I went to oh, five I... more... My friend, shut up, I'm talking. I went to five more pastors and they mentioned your name. They said you used my destiny to fly abroad. Until I met the last person, a very powerful man of God. He assured me that God in heaven will not allow me to be put to shame. Oh, God, God. God, you are bigger than what they say you are. That was how I was rescued from you. 
He turned everything around, threw you inside prison, and I came back alive and had this shot. You want to take it? Thunder fire you. Come and take it. 